Hello, everybody. Uh, I need about 400 more views on brighteon.com to um, keep 500 videos. They're still going to delete uh, around 250 videos, even if I get the the uh, next 400 views. But, you know, better than nothing, I suppose. I was considering abandoning YouTube and going to Brighteon and then they decided that I don't have enough views and they're going to start deleting videos. So much for freedom of speech. I guess freedom of speech as long as you have uh, have lots of views for them to sell Mike Adams's stuff. All right, so in the description and in the pinned comment on top, I've got some links. Uh, there are, let's see, half a dozen videos. Some of them are less than a minute. So if you could click on one, watch it for 30 seconds, click, you know, the other one, wait for 30 seconds. Uh, one of them's Oprah saying that racists have to die. And, you know, when she's talking about racists dying, uh, take a guess what group of people she's thinking about. And, uh, but all these, you know, 10 minutes, please take 10 minutes of your time and click on them. And then I've got the, the Psalms playlist. And the majority of those are like three minutes long. You could just click on the playlist and let it play. And I think 30 minutes to an hour, I think, well, about 45 minutes, it'll play out. And you've, you will have listened to probably about 15 videos. And uh, so, if, you know, maybe 50 of you do this for me. You'll be helping me out. I'd appreciate it. Um, I'm going to finish up the wall series. But I've got another thing, too. Uh, I was thinking, why... How did the wicked gain so much power? Well, they gain control of our money system. That's how. And I I think the next video I'm going to do, I'm going to do probably five to ten minute video on how they gain control of the so much wealth in the world. Uh, believe it or not, I was a, well, I, I took computer science, but I also took business in college, economics, uh, only got a C in accounting. I'm not very, I wasn't, yeah, accounting. I, I don't know. Uh, the teacher was most generous giving me a C in accounting. But uh, economics, I did very well in economics. Um, I had the uh, chair and the assistant chair of the economics business, to, uh, the, the head professors. So I do understand what's going on, but it's going to be on the uh, Federal Reserve banking system, which a lot of people don't know it, but it's a private corporation with a government charter. And they basically print money. So, and I'm going to show, I'm going to go through it. I, I'm you know, every time I think it's 10 minutes, it ends up being half an hour. But, you know, when I get done with it, you'll understand uh, how they did it in the United States. But they've done the same thing in other countries. So they uh, convince the king or the rulers, you know, when I say king, I'm, you know, like in Europe, to uh, replace the uh, silver and gold coins with paper money. And then what they do is they tell you, well, you know, you can exchange the paper money for gold or silver. And, you know, who wants to carry around, you know, several pounds of coins? I mean, you know, paper so convenient. All you got to do is go to the bank and exchange it. Well, then after you get used to that, they change it and say, oh, well, no, no, you can't redeem the paper for gold or silver anymore. So, the next thing you know, uh, you don't, <laughs> your money's worthless. 
It's just an IOU printed on a piece of paper. And uh, that's what happened in but after World War I to uh, Germany. Uh, they had what's called hyperinflation. It was so bad that uh, the paper money became worthless. It took a wheelbarrow of paper money to buy a loaf of bread. And I'm not joking. That's the truth. And that was the conditions under which Hitler was elected, or selected, I should say, by his father, the devil, to come to power. Yeah, I know, some people worship Hitler and think he was a great guy and all this, but, you know, if Hitler was doing God's work, Germany would have won the war. So, I, I just don't see it. Hitler didn't found, Hitler founded zero Bible colleges, I never heard him say the word Jesus Christ. I heard him say the word God, but that doesn't mean nothing. Uh, the Church of Satan talks about God too, but they're talking about Satan, the devil. That's their God. You know, so just because you hear somebody talk about God, that doesn't mean anything. You can go to India and they talk about God too. Uh, are they talking about Brahma, Shiva, Vishnu, Krishna? Who are they talking about? You know, Shiva the Destroyer, uh, Kali. Uh, who are they talking about? Not the God of the Bible, not the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, uh, not Emmanuel. No. So, you know, just, yeah. Uh, so please, please, please do that for me. Um, I only need about another 400 views. And uh, I need to, I've been listening to my own videos a lot too and listening to the playlists, uh, trying to get some views done so they don't delete all my things in the next 10 days. So, all right, well, all blessings, praise, glory, and honor to Lamb of God, Jesus, slain before the foundation of the world. Amen.